Hey YouTube here. Hey YouTube, how you doing? This is Mike Sticky Six 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 again. But this time I'm gonna tell you how you could get on someone's computer wirelessly. But you'd have to be their good friend or something like that to do this. Because you have to know the name of their computer and their IP address. And the only way to do that is to go on a certain site or go to the main computer hard drive, system information. But let's get back on to it. First, you find out what you first you gotta get angry IP scanner. Find out someone's or maybe if you have two computers to do this, you could plug you could find the IP address of your computer and then in angry IP scanner type in the range of yours back in between two IP addresses then scan for it and if you find your computer name on the, on the list with the green dot that means you can get on it and you could literally get on their computer and shut it down yourself instead of walking a mile <laughs> just kidding but it's safe if you only do this in your own house because otherwise it would be considered illegal because you it would be considered hacking and so just be safe about it don't break the law whenever it comes to this I'm not trying to encourage you to I'm just trying to teach you how to get on your own computer it might be fun or something anyway but it, and then once you find it double click it and then type it on your on command prompt ping and then type in the name of their computer. Like, like say mine. Muck Sticky PC. There it is. And then enter and it, it finds it. And if it does find it, then you, well, if you, it didn't find it, it would say ping request could not find host name. Please check the name and try again. But if it did work, it would get you logged on and you'd be able to do this. Type in, um, then once you type in ping Muxtiki's PC, which is an example, it doesn't really exist, you would, and if it finds it, then you would, um, the IP, and we're IP scanner. Um, and if if it was the right one when you type it in on command prompt, it'll give you the IP address. So in the angry IP scanner, make it from a random number, and then I mean no no, just type in because the newest one should just be one number. Type in whatever came up, and then enter it. Let it scan all of them. And if it finds the right one and it's green, a green dot, double click it and there you go. It'll work. But I'm begging of you, please do not get on in anyone else's computer unless you have permission. Because then I might get blamed for telling you how. So, yeah, this is MuckSticky666 and I am...